What's up, Cloud Clan? X Cloud here, bringing you another episode of my Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we spent a lot of time trying to find a blue shard just so we could evolve uh, Erastimus here, but we do have a Ludicolo, and we came back here, and Rayquaza came down from the sky and told Growlithe on Kyogre to shut up. And then we followed up with a grinding montage, and as you can see, everyone's level 44. I figured 44 would be fine. Um, Juan's ace is level 46, so I think we should we should uh, be able to fare just fine against uh, his Pokemon. So let's uh, head up to see Juan and uh, try to get our 8th gym badge. Let's see if I could do this correctly on the first try. So far so good. Yep, okay, we made it uh, to Juan. Juan! And I don't really know who we want to lead with. Get that Intimidate off. Let me ask you, did you know? Ah, I should not be so coy. It was I who taught Wallace everything there is to know about Pokemon. Once I had given up my position as the gym leader, in my place I had entrusted Wallace with the gym. However, a compelling reason arose for me to make a comeback. Ah, but enough chatter, let's begin our match, shall we? Please, you shall bear witness to my artistry. A grand illusion of water sculpted by a Pokemon and myself. Okay, I still am a little nervous though. Not gonna lie. Gym Junkie Juan. He starts off actually with a water type. So Katie is not gonna stay in here at all. Let's actually go into... Let's go into Austin. I would go into Erasmus, but um, Giga Drain only has 5 PP in this generation, which I thought was kind of weird. And uh, we're just going to go for... Let's... I wish I had Thunder right now, because um, in the rain, Thunder is 100% accurate. But we one shot we one shot the octillery anyway. Not even bad. Alright, Tentacruel's gonna come out, so I guess we could just stay in. He actually did have water Pokemon. This is kinda weird. This is really weird. Let's go for another Thunderbolt here. See if we can one shot this Tentacruel. Oh, oh wow. Oh wow. One HP left. So he goes for a frustration and gets the paralysis. So that's all good and dandy. He might uh, use a... Some kind of potion or full restore here. So I'm just going to go for another Thunderbolt. As he does, he goes for the hyper potion. Um, he does get his health all the way back up. So this Thunderbolt may not kill again. If we can get maximum amount of damage, it will kill though, so let's hope for that. Ooh, we, we land a crit, so... Austin's in here not messing around. He really wants this 8th uh, and final gym leader. Okay, Rosalia is coming in. Not a, uh, not a water type now. And uh, we can just go for, go for some overheats and... Uh, Oh, this is his ace. Rosalia is his ace. Okay. Ooh, if I should have switched in um, Shogun to go for the uh, flying type attack because it is raining, so overheat. It's not going to do as much damage as it normally would. But we still Oko it with another critical hit. That is all good, all good. Okay, so he's got two Pokemon left. One of them's going to be a Butterfree, so I'm actually going to switch into Shogunna here. And uh, just go for some flying type moves. And we should be able to uh, take it up pretty easily. Level 41, yeah, I'm sure this aerial ace should one shot. Another critical hit that was at like three in a row. <laughs> oh wow, I'm not even complaining though. That's pretty nice. Scizor, okay, so Katie's going to finish off his last Pokemon. I don't think Scizor can really do much to our Arcanine. 
We get the Intimidate off, make him even even more, um, or even less of a threat. We miss our Overheat, and he gets a Sword Stance off. Alright, so he's a uh, plus one now. We land our Overheat, that's a dead Scizor, I don't care what anyone says. Four times effective, Fire-type attack, Scizor's dead. <clears throat> Excuse me. And that'll be the 8th Gym Badge. Ah, <laughs> excellent. Very well. You are the winner. From you, I sense the brilliant shine of skill that will overcome all. However, compared with me or even Wallace, you are looking you are lacking in elegance. Perhaps I should make you a loan of my outfit. <laughs> I merely jest. Rather than my clothes, I shall reward you with this, the rain badge. Thank you, sir. There's the eighth and final badge, finally. Our journey is uh, coming to a close, but we still have Victory Road, the Elite Four, and the Champion left, standing in our way of victory of this Nuzlocke. The trainers who have gathered all the gym badges of Hoenn should make way to the ultimate destination, the Pokemon League, travel to the easternmost reaches of Hoenn, to the Island Evergrande. There you shall find the Pokemon League, and that's where we shall go. Let's exit out of this gym. Goodbye and fare farewell. We will not be seeing you ever again. Yow, you've beaten Ethan's one, who was supposedly the best in all Hoenn. Okay, check out your trainer card. If you've gotten all the badges, you're set for the Pokemon League challenge. Hasta la vista. Let's just go heal up really quick, even though we don't really have much to heal. And we're going to make our way towards Evergrande City. Um, I think we still need to teach someone Waterfall. I'll double check that when we get uh, close to Evergrande City. Because so I'm sure we have two Pokemon, at least, that can learn Waterfall. Do some repels here. Do we still have repels though? We've got some super repels. Let's go with that and go with that. Alright, Evergrande City is over this way somewhere. Uh, da -da -da -da. Oh. I'm gonna check my map just to be sure I'm going the right way. We need to go south a bit. A bit. Speed it up a little. Nope, nope, not here. Not here. Not here. <laughs> Keep feeling my voice is gonna crack like I'm losing my voice or something. Maybe it's just because, uh. I'm pretty tired. Where are we? Where are we? Are we even going the right way? Okay! Apparently I haven't battled this dude. Oops, some of my chains just fell. Koji! Level 34 Beldum. Uh, not too bad, but... Not a threat. We're 10 levels higher. Okay, so let's continue. Okay, yes, okay. Um, I'm guessing we're in the wrong area. We need to go... Probably this way. This looks like a little enclosed area. Let's try going down here. Alright, now I think we're on the right trail. Use our last and final super repel. We might still have some max repels though. Here we are, Evergrande City. We've already had an encounter for this area. Yeah, no one knows... No one knows Waterfall. Ooh. He gave us Water Pulse. Okay. Um, actually. Actually. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. what's the power of Waterfall? 80. Okay. Let's teach, um, Waterfall to Erastamus. Um, get rid of Nature Power. And we're going to teach 
Water Pulse to Jake. And we're gonna get rid of... Can we get rid of Dive? No, we can't. Let's just get rid of Rapid Spin. I don't think we really need that. And we're gonna use our first Waterfall. There we go. Got a Pokemon Center up here. Alright, so uh, let's tackle Victory Road. It's been a while since I've been in this Victory Road. I don't remember how difficult it was, but we can get an encounter here after our repel wears off. I guess we could just uh, try to make our way through here. Well, I don't know. If, if there's a Pokemon that we catch that I want to use... It's a, a Hypno. For some reason, I wanted to say we already had a Hypno. But I guess not. I guess not. Um, we can, we can uh, catch this thing, I guess. I think this might be our final encounter, to be honest. I don't remember if there's any areas out of here that give us the opportunity to catch anything. And uh, let's go for uh, Shockwave because hopefully this won't kill it. Don't kill it, Austin. Don't kill it. Okay, not even half. Okay. So I don't think he'll be able to take a third Shockwave. Ooh, he might. But I'm not going to risk it at the moment. We're just going to throw some Pokeballs at this Hypno. We've got like 97 regular Pokeballs, so I think it should be fine. And we catch it with the first one. Not even bad. So we're going to have to nickname this thing. The arching movement and glitter of the pendulum in Hypno's hand lull the foe into deep hypnosis. While searching for prey, it polishes the pendulum. That's kind of creepy if you think about it. Alright, I'm going to go on my channel real quick and find someone to name this Hypno after. I'll be right back. Alrighty, we're gonna name this, uh, we're gonna name this Hypno Light after, after a subscriber. So we've got a Hypno, let me check really quick. Alright, we're all good, uh, Austin has a little bit of health loss, but that's okay. Let's see how many repels we have. This, repels are not in that section, what am I doing? We have six max repels. I'm actually going to buy some more, just, uh, just to be sure we can get through here completely. So, I don't think there's a Pokemart up here. Yeah, no Pokemart up here, so we do need to fly back to... I guess it doesn't really matter, let's just fly to Moss Deep City. And uh, pick up some Repels. Not too many though, because I want to save some money for full restores. So... Max Repels. I think... 20 should be, um... More than enough. And we're fine on Hyper Potions, we still have 59 of those. So, uh... Wait, can we even fly there yet? Do you have to go in the Pokemon Center? Okay, thank you. I couldn't remember if you had to go in the Pokemon Center to uh, get the fly location. I think there's a game that you had to do that in, but I don't remember. Let's just heal really, uh, heal up really quick because Austin had a little bit of damage on him. Nothing too serious, but... I like having no damage on anything when we're going through places. So let's start off this place with a Max Chappelle. See, uh, see how long this will take us. I don't think there's anything over here. There's a trainer here. Everyone's the same level, so no need to switch anyone out. Espeon, okay. We've got a nice bite right here. Can we get a flinch? Can we get a flinch? No flinch. Okay, side beam shouldn't do too much. That's a decent amount, though. Flinch? No flinch. Okay. Don't crit, please. <gasps> Full restore? Really? That scared the crap out of me.
This Espeon's not even playing around. I need to calm down. Thank you. <sighs> Alright, so that's Espeon out of the way, and Katie grows to level 45. Swablu's about to come out, so... Wow, we don't have any Ice-type attacks, do we? Or Dragon. I, uh... After this episode, I might need to look up where some TMs are. We need, we should get some TMs before we actually face the Pokemon League. But, uh, Swablu? Austin should be able to take out Swablu just fine. Wait, Swablu's, Swablu's not even a Dragon-type yet. It's normal flying. So, uh, Electric's super effective against it. So this Thunderbolt should probably take it out. I don't think Swablu's defenses are very good. Not against a uh, Thunderbolt from an Ampharos, especially. Alright, so that's the uh, first trainer in the... In the uh, in Victory Road down. We're switching Katie out of the front slot. So uh, she's safe from dying for now. <laughs> that critical hit scared me. I hate critical hits so much. Any Pokemon that you get in a Nuzlocke that has, uh, what is it? I think it's some kind of armor ability. Uh, whichever ability it is that makes it so you can't be hit by critical hits, that's an amazing ability to have on your Pokemon when you're doing a Nuzlocke. Oh right, we face a uh, Wally here. Hi Cloud, I bet you're surprised to see me here. I made it all the way here, and it's all thanks to you, Cloud. Losing to you that time made me stronger. But I'm not going to lose anymore. I'm going to win for the Pokemon who gave me courage and strength. Okay, here I come. I actually don't even know what level his Pokemon are. He's a Gyarados level 44. Alright, Erastimus, uh, we're not staying in, especially... Well, you're more of a special attacker than a physical. But uh, we're going to switch into Austin. Hopefully this Gyarados does not have Earthquake. That put us in a pickle. Swagger? Really? Really, Wally? You run a Swagger on your Gyarados. Alright. Come on. Come on, Austin. Don't paralyze me. Don't paralyze me. Don't paralyze me. Thank you. Austin, break through and kill this Gyarados for me, please. No, you don't. I'm healing up. Because that's an uncomfortable amount of HP that I'm at. He goes for another Body Slam. And he gets paralyzed, so... That's, uh, that's favorable hacks on my side. We're not gonna heal up, we're just gonna go for a Thunderbolt. We snap out of Confusion. That's a dead Gyarados. That's a dead Gyarados. Have a nice day. See you later. Decent amount of experience there. Uh, Slow King's gonna come out. Uh, do we stay in or just go into Erastimus? I think Erastimus could put in some work. Alright, Slow King, what's up? What's up? Uh, Giga Drain! See how well you take this. He might take it fairly well. He does take it, he takes it really well. He's gonna go for uh, frustration. That doesn't do much at all, and we're gonna get another Giga Drain off. So we're gonna, I'm guessing we're gonna heal up almost all of our HP, if not all of it. And uh, he's probably gonna heal his Slow King here. So I'm actually gonna go for a, uh, a Surf because. Two more Giga Drains will take him out after a Surf for sure. Cause this shouldn't do too much. Yeah, that did about the amount that he had left. And see, Giga Drain only has 5 uh, PP in this generation, so... Um, I might use some PP ups on those if we have any left. I don't think we've used any of them. It doesn't look like another Giga Drain will take him out though, he puts me to sleep. Alright Slow King, I see you. I see. We're not going to stay in. We're actually just going to switch out into Austin. Because I don't want to deal with sleep right now. No sleep right now. Swift isn't going to do much. 
Axes a little bit more than I thought it would, but a Thunderbolt will take him out. See you later, Slowking. Okay, so that's, uh, how, I, 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 up, 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 up. I wasn't paying attention to what he had left. I kind of like those hiccups. Let me take a drink real quick. Okay, there's three Pokemon left. And we're actually right on par with his team. I don't think Sandslash will take Surf very well. It should kill. I want to say it'll kill. It does kill with another critical hit. That's like at least four critical hits in this episode from us. Electrode. <sighs> That's scary. Electrodes can blow up. Who has high defenses? I want to say Blastoise, but Electrode is super effective. He has 137 HP. It's not bad. Alright, Erastimus. You got this, right? <sighs> Electrode. Let's wake him up and uh, see what this Electrode wants to go for. Please don't blow up. Shockwave, okay. We should take that fine. It is neutral. We do take that fine. Let's go for a Surf here. Wow, Electrode, are you really going to do this? You're going to try to make me miss my Surfs. But I'm not missing my Surfs. This should do, I want to say, at least half. Yep, a little over half. And he does not explode. So if we land this Surf, that's a dead Electrode. Thank you. No blowing up for you. No blowing up for you. So that's all good. That's all good. And a Mawile is last. Just a Steel type. Katie should be able to handle this thing just fine. Plus we get the Intimidate on it, so... It doesn't even scare me, even at the health we're at. Oh no, we don't get the Intimidate because of the, uh, its ability. But we do land the Overheat. That should be a dead Mawile. It's not a Mega Mawile, it's a Generation 3. Yep, that's a, that's a dead Mawile. Oh yeah, that was, that's what, that was the uh, Pokemon he caught at first. Now I remember, and this was the Pokemon we had at first, so it's kind of cool. Wow, Cloud, you are strong after all. I couldn't beat you today, Cloud, but one of these days, I'll catch up to you. Will you, Will, will you, Ollie? Will you? Let's just heal everyone up with Hyper Potions and continue on through. I don't remember if we still have a Repel up, so I'm not going to use another one just yet. Alright, got another trainer here. She only has a Crobat. Ooh, nope, not staying in on the Crobat. Austin will take care of this Crobat for us, though. There's the air cutter. Let's go for a nice Thunderbolt. And this Thunderbolt should take it out, because Crobat's not very defensive unless you have it specifically... IV and EV for defense. Uh, I don't even know if Crobat's that defensive anyway because I don't know his, st his base stats. But Austin does grow to level 45. And, uh. I don't know when Katie's supposed to learn extreme speed. Wow. Flash. It's Flash and HM. Okay, good. Oh, Austin knows Flash. I forgot about that. I was thinking to a Zeta. I was like, we don't have Saria in our party. Saria can't use Flash. Alright, so we've got a little, uh, this shouldn't be too hard. One and two. Three and four. What's up here? Repel wears off. Okay, so... We need to not use a Hyper Potion. We need to use another Max Repel. Let's see what's over here. 
An item, maybe? Guess we'll find out, or maybe that's the way we actually need to go. There is another trainer over here, so let's just battle her really quick to get her out of the way. And, uh, we'll see what's down there. Kakuna at level 45. What are you even doing with your life? Does Kakuna hate you that much that it doesn't even want to evolve into a Beedrill? Or are you just too stubborn to let your Kakuna evolve? Okay, so that's the way we need to go, I'm sure. I need, I'm gonna backtrack a little bit just to make sure we didn't miss anything. Like, we didn't go this way. And uh, there's another trainer here. <coughs> Excuse me again. There's another trainer here. A Steelix, okay. Hold this Surf real quick. That's a dead Steelix. And Erastimus is gonna level up. Tentacruel. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. he doesn't have. I keep wanting to wait, 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 wait. We still have Earthquake, don't we? I haven't put it on anybody yet. I kind of want to put it on Peregrine. But uh, we're just gonna send in Austin, I guess, because he will handle his Tentacruel just fine, just fine. Ooh, barely lives on. Sets up a barrier. No big deal. Oh. Should have guessed they had the full restore. Let's use two shockwaves to take him out, though. And he had three Pokemon, right? So he's got one more. It's gonna be a Lombre. Okay, so Shogunna. Just gonna come in here and go for nice Aerial Ace. Fake out, really? You gotta do this. You gotta do this. No. Wow. He actually lived that. Quick attack. See you later, Lombre. Alright, now let's see what else is this way. What else is this way? Actually, we might need to go this way. I don't even know. Oh, I hate caves so much. I hate caves. There's an item up here, though. Let's see what this is. Full restore? Okay. That's one less that I'll need to buy. Nope, oh, nope, nope, there we go. So the question is, do we go down the ladder or do we go up that ladder? I want to go up the ladder first. Um, so let's run back over there. Got to break through everything, got to push everything out of the way again. Careful not to hit that one or else we won't be able to make it through. There we go, there we go. Alright, let's go down to the ladder over here. Here, where does this take us? A PP up. Okay, there's a there's one PP up, and then there's an Ultra Ball, which we won't need anymore because I don't know if we have any encounters left or not. But uh, we can go down this ladder now. Still in Victory Road, so no encounters for us. But uh, let's put someone else out in front. Let's put Jake out front and battle this trainer here. Please don't have a lot of Pokemon. You got three? Okay. Uh... Why do they make me cry inside whenever I see one of Trico's evolutions? Because I've wanted it from like the very beginning. Leave a like if you cry every time. Because I do. I do. We don't have any rock type attacks, do we? I just realized that. That's okay though, I guess. We've got Austin in here to take care of flying types. Drill Peck. That's resisted. That's not gonna do too much at all. Yep, that's a dead Fero and a Doduo too, okay. Doduo, please use fly. Ooh. <gasps> Drill! Stop doing that! That was even closer than Katie's uh, crit that she got hit. Julie, algae trader, Julie. Why you almost killing Austin? Oh my gosh! There's two close calls in this episode. Oh. 
I didn't think a tri attack would do that much damage, but it was a crit. We got lucky, to be honest. We have to play more cautiously, even though I've been playing fairly cautiously so far. Is there anything over here? Yep, elixir, okay. There's another trainer here. Vito Stantler. No. Intimidate's not gonna matter. That's gonna matter. We're just gonna stay in here and uh, try to wake up. Oh, really? You're gonna play this game? You're gonna try and lower my... Alright, that did a decent amount. I don't like that. Alright, we're gonna have to switch out. Oops. I need to stop using the speed up button so much, to be honest. This victory road's not messing around. I could use it for that. But like when I'm doing- oh my goodness, are you serious, Stantler? I'm using a full restore. Or not a full restore, a uh, full heal. I hate Stantler. He's one of the Pokemon our dad had. Every Pokemon that our dad had I don't like. I don't like him anymore. We had death there. There's a brick break. That should kill Stantler. I'm sure of it. It does. Thank you. Thank you. Get out of here. You and your sleep crap. Meganium. Okay. Shogunna come through. Oh. Oh, wow. Bye bye. Nope. Nope, nope, not slamming me. Not today. Oh, synthesis, really? Bye bye. Wow! Wow, Meganium. Wow, don't paralyze me. Thank you. Alright. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Uh, thank you. Thank you. Alright, Altaria. We need an Ice or Dragon type attack. We really do. Did we even catch any Dragon types in this playthrough? I don't think we have. I don't think we have. We could have if our Trap Inch didn't die. Still upset about that. I wanted to use a Flygon. Austin's 46, now the highest level on the team. Nidoran, female. Katie's got the dig. What? Oh, the mist protected it from the intimidate. I didn't know that. That should take out the Nidoran. Ooh, it lives. And we get poisoned. That poison point. And it flatters. What's flatter do? I don't remember. Lowers our special. Oh. Oh, it's like swagger, but for special attacks. Okay. Okay. Uh, I think we should be okay. Uh, full restore, of course. Wow, that bite did a lot of damage. Uh, I think we should be just fine, though. We are just fine, and we take out the Nidoran. So let's, uh, heal everybody up. Get rid of that, that stupid poison. And this is a full heal. Alright, I'll take it. Let's go up, 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 anywhere up here that we need to go. There's another waterfall there. So many trainers in here. Uh-oh. We're done. We're done for. This thing's gonna kill us. It's gonna wipe out our entire team. Oh, it's setting up already. It's setting up already. We're dead. We're dead. Oh, oh, look at that damage. That was, a, that was a close call. That was terrifying. Oh, Trap Inch. No, they have to do this to me. Uh, I'm sad. I'm so sad. So sad to cry. Cry. Hopefully this episode's not too long. Um, I plan to get all the way through Victory Road in this episode. 
Uh, Jake needs. They, I, yeah, I'm gonna heal up. Uh, heal everyone up. Austin should be. Nope, nope. Not playing around. He had two HP left. Every bit of HP counts. Okay. I should have actually switched Austin back because he has level 46 and we still have level 44s. Arcanine and Iggly buff. That's fine by me. I mean, we're not physical attackers. And they're not gonna want to take this surf. I don't know. Let's just go for Iggly buff, I guess. Double team. It's not gonna matter. You're gonna hit with this surf, aren't you? Yeah, you are. All right, I I figured. Okay, it's still it's gonna hit the Arcanine either way. No, it's not because they switch in like that. Gotcha. Kills the Torchic anyway. That is fine. Double edge. All right, all right. And they got one Pokemon left. There you go, Jake. There you go, Jake. And it's gonna be a Togetic, and Togetic's not gonna appreciate this Thunderbolt. Oh, uh, that was fairly easy. Actually, it's really easy. All right, so we can move on. Press onward. So many trainers, but uh, I want to battle them because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to grind for the uh, for the Pokemon League. So this is just a quicker way of gaining experience that I'm not gonna have to gain when I am grinding. All right, down goes the Porygon. He's got a Parasect. Okay. Nope, Shogunna. Shogunna's lower level than KD is. He's about to level up too. Boom! You're dead, Parasect. Swalot? Swal not? Swal not gonna stand a chance against this dig. Ooh, he's probably gonna live this actually. Yeah, I figured. Oh, are you serious? You're gonna toxic me? You're gonna toxic me! Alright, 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 alright. Don't stockpile and this will kill you. Oh! He's not gonna die. Because he's stupid. Ah. Uh, oops. Alright. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. Freaking Swalot. So annoying. Bye bye. Austin doesn't like you. Don't mess with the team. Don't mess with the team. Austin will destroy your face. He's like, oh, Katie's in trouble? Nope. You're dead. Don't mess with my friends. I got their back. I got their back. Oh, there's a Max Chappelle there. Cool, cool. Um. I don't know which way this is. Alright, we came from this way. So we just need to go this way and go in here. There's an item here. Psychic! Ooh, 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 ooh. Any items in these rocks? No items in the rocks, okay. I'm curious though. I want to see who can learn Psychic. Psychic. Nobody. I figured as much. I figured as much. Alright, let's see. I don't think we need to go down. I didn't mean to jump over that, but uh, it's okay. It's okay. We've got repels. So let's figure out which way we need to go. We came from there, I think. So we do need to surf across this, I think. Do we need to go down the other side of the waterfall? Because we didn't do that yet. I don't, did we? I have such a short-term memory sometimes. Aha! Aha! Here we go. Possible double battle. Peregrine's going to be in on this one. And so is Erastimus. Looks good to me. Come on, turn, lady. Please, turn. Hey. Hey, lady! Thank you. You just gotta yell at her and she'll be like, what? Who said my name? Who said my name? 
All right, Croconaw and Grand Bull. This is fine. This is just fine. Intimidate. Peregrine says, <laughs> what Intimidate? I'm still going to kill you. Getting along Giga Drains, though. Oh, it doesn't quite kill. That's okay, though. Does he have... They all, they're all living at like 1 HP. So, uh, let's go for another Brick Break and a Surf. Aragadoki. Machoke? Nope. See ya. And that does a decent amount to Machoke. And they've got a Snorlax. Let's just punch this Snorlax and go for a Surf. Uh, Surf might take him out. Nope. Snorlax is too bulky, but let's take out the Machoke, thankfully. And Snorlax is gonna... Oh! Oh, no! Are you kidding me? Oh, that Intimidate really mattered because he would have died. Wow. Well, I guess we could use that Hypno. <sighs> this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. He's helping us in his uh, afterlife because he's dead, but he's still crushing and moving rocks. Gonna miss you. Gonna miss you, Peregrine. Oh, that's so lame. That's so lame. It's such a bummer. It's such a bummer. Oh, uh, Cotton Spore, really? Still at speed though, so it's okay. Um, I kind of do want to get another encounter, but I don't know. I don't know. I need to see what we have in our box. Uh, did we come from up? Yeah, we came from up there. Okay. Up, oh, double battle, double battle. Screw you and your double battles. I know we did miss a trainer back there, but I kind of just want to get out of here and uh, heal up uh, and find a replacement. And then uh, I'll probably start the next episode with a grinding montage. I need to check the, uh, I'm going to check the Pokemon League's, uh, levels just to make sure we're not too overleveled. I mean, I do want to be leveled up, or overleveled a little bit, because, uh, we have to make it all the way through there. I don't know why I went for quick attack. We're going to make it all the way through there on, uh, without healing anybody, and we're going to, well, I mean, we're going to have, like, full resource and everything, but... Um, we're probably gonna run low on PP, and that's the main problem that I'm worried about. But other than that, I think we'll be okay. This is, unfortunately, a rather long episode. Aw, uh, you are gonna use Sunny Day, and now my Surf's not gonna do as much damage. Wow, Shogunna, you miss! What are you doing? Wow, it does like nothing to that clay doll. Let's bite it. Let's bite that clay doll. There you go. Critical hit, super effective. Not bad. Not bad, Jake. Alright. You're a disgrace. Can we exit out of here? Here we go. The exit. Evergrande City. Any encounters here? Are there any encounters here? Nope! So it looks like we are out of encounters. But that's okay. Let's see... Who we have.
All these lower levels. Uh, I guess we could bring light. I'd say he's our next, next, uh, good bet. Oh, Peregrine. Stupid Snorlax. Snorlax with counter? Wow. Alright, so we gotta put Peregrine in the dead box, unfortunately. This dead box makes me really sad. Look at this. Look at all this. There's a lot of powerful Pokemon in here. So it looks like we are going to add Light to our party. Because he is the one that's, uh, actually... Actually, wait a second. We do have a Moonstone. And uh, we do need someone who's more worthy of Earthquake. I think Dronigan here is honestly the better choice. I think I think he is. I think he is. So uh, yeah, that's gonna be he's gonna be put in our team now. And uh, let's see if he can prove himself against the Pokemon League in the next episode. Now, I don't know if... Um, I think I might in the next episode will be the Elite Four only. And then I'll leave the Champion to be its own episode. The, the next two episodes will probably be a little bit shorter. But that's okay by me. I mean, this one's almost 50 minutes long. But uh, the next episode will begin with a montage. We mainly need to get Dronigan up to level. And get him up to be a nice, powerful Nido King. And uh, that's pretty exciting. He'll kind of replace the uh, place of Gyre Wave, which we did lose a few episodes ago. But um, next episode, we'll be taking on the Elite Four. We're really close to ending this series. Uh, it's really, really exciting. It's been a fun time. But I'm also really excited for uh, the next series that I'm going to be uploading after this one. But if you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like, a comment, and maybe even subscribe. And I'll see you next time.